Hey, I'm Jason Clark, and I'm one of the producers on A Million Ways to Die in the West. Thank you. And um, tell us, where are we here tonight? What are we well, we're at the, uh, at the world premiere of A Million Ways to Die in the West at the beautiful Westwood Village Theater in Westwood Village, California. This is a uh, momentous night. It's very warm out, so I'm sweating like a pig underneath this. But uh, that is probably more from nerves than the heat. But it is close to 100 degrees, so it could be both. Kind of reminiscent of your shooting days, right? Exactly. We, uh, we battled wind, every imaginable weather making this movie. You know, it's a Western, and it's set in the high desert. And God damn it, the high desert is a hard place to shoot, I will tell you. It was a hard place for those people to settle and live in. And there were some, you know, a million ways to die in the West. So it, uh, it, it, it was... Uh, you know, truth follows fiction in some cases, and this is one of those cases. Right, right, right. Um, and what, what, what do you think, uh, if you were to tell people who haven't seen this, like, why they should go see it and what they can expect from this movie? Well, you know, I think the unexpected piece of this movie is that it has this kind of rich world that the, the comedy lives in. So it's very funny, and it's, it's, it's part of, like, what Seth MacFarlane is so brilliant at, which is to have kind of a grounded world but add this element that's kind of crazy and, and, and outside of that world. And that's the way people speak. You know, we have this kind of iconoclastic voice of these characters. We have a, a voice of the characters which is anachronistic to this kind of Western theme, yet the world is very authentic for 1880s Western Arizona. I know we shot it in New Mexico, but we say it's Arizona. Okay. I dare you to tell me it isn't. <laughs> I would believe you. <laughs> and uh, just final is, what, uh, what's it like being a part of working with a, a creative like Seth MacFarlane? Well, working with Seth is amazing. He's, uh, he's a genius. And, 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 you know, and I've been doing this for a long time, and getting the opportunity is just a thrill for me to work with someone who you have so much uh, faith in their decisions and their choices and he's a kind uh, uh, um, an incredible collaborator and and then add to that this incredible cast you know Charlize Theron, Liam Neeson, Giovanni Ribisi, Sarah Silverman, uh, Neil Patrick Harris I mean it just goes on and on this incredible cast and we had one of the greatest experiences of my life making this movie and it was hard it wasn't easy I mean we had to battle the weather we had issues there was a scene we shot with Charlize that took us three attempts to get to because the first attempt got rained out the second attempt attempt got flooded out in such a way that we had flash flooding and had to leave the set because there was like literally serious danger for people. I remember walking into Charlize's trailer, drenched wet, defeated, because this is the second time we, uh, we attempted the scene, and saying, we've got to go right now. Like, there's no time, like, no packing. Just get and go before the road washes out. And the third time was the charm, and we completed the scene. Wow. A million ways to die. <laughs> <laughs> A million ways to die in the West. Thank you so much for your time. It's a great movie. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Yeah.